to for me to get used to this car because last race I did was in Formula One in Abu Dhabi 2020. So uh, the least I can say, the cars are quite different to drive, but a very interesting experience. It's uh, always been fascinating me to try the NASCAR car, and I'm very happy finally it happened. I really enjoyed it. It was really cool, and I'm looking forward to tomorrow. What do you think the interest is in your country of stock car racing? I mean, Formula One, you know, we understand that internationally, but what do you think the interest in NASCAR is? The interest? It interests. Interest. I think uh, I think it can it can be very high. I mean, everyone uh, uh, loves racing, uh, you know, uh, where, where I'm from. Uh, so it's obviously interesting. Everyone likes to drive fast. I think everywhere uh, in Europe it can grow. Uh, the more uh, F1 drivers will come, I think, into NASCAR, the more worldwide interest will, will, will grow. I think it's very it's very good that the also Mimi Raikkonen is joining next next uh, race in the Watkins Glen. So should be both of us there, uh, hopefully, and then. Uh, it's you know then more Formula One fans also will uh, uh, be attracted to NASCAR. I think the racing here is great. You know, uh, it's great to uh, to bring the interest and uh, racing is very interesting. I'm sure everyone will love it. What do, you, what do you say to the people who might think that there's not as much talent or skill needed in NASCAR as opposed to Formula One or something that you, more your background? Well, uh, I never heard anyone saying that to be honest. First of all, because. Uh, these are two opposite worlds, you know, the way the, tri uh, the cars drive, the way how you need to drive them, they're the complete opposites, like day and night. They're both really cool fun, great fun in different ways, but the guys here, they do this kind of racing since they are seven years old, you know, eight years old. So I just think they're completely in the territory, but like I said, it was very important to do a few important laps. Then we are a very, very small team, uh, don't forget that, we're just starting up and uh, the car was ready really last moment. If you were in the factory, you would be amazed how, how much effort was put in and how everything was last moment, you know, the car, this car really was uh, put together with love. <laughs> how many races are you planning to run this year? I think uh, this one, uh, Watkins Glen, uh, most likely, and then uh, hopefully uh, the next uh, road course is, is uh, in Roval in Charlotte, hopefully that one too. Well, were you wondering when you would get to race again, obviously with some of the FIA regulations and stuff and you have plans that were kind of that you were going to race? Well, I think, uh, yes, of course, and I think uh, I can, honestly, I can race if I want to, uh, it's not a problem. Uh, but uh, yeah, it was, it was great to, to get together with NASCAR to get this opportunity. A great uh, example of, uh, of sportsmanship and uh, yeah, uh, sport is, it is great uh, here, you know, to show the sport is great uh, for everyone. And uh, yeah, at the moment, like I said, I think it's some other interviews. I'm focused on NASCAR. I'm not thinking about any other championships at the moment. I want to give my all energy here to get uh, as much experience and laps here in order to uh, to become really competitive here one day. Well, Do you want to be a full-time? He, he remarked how inclusive NASCAR was as far as you could go to your you know, neighbor's garage and see what was going on, that they would help out and everything. It, is that the biggest difference you know, from an off-track situation that you see compared to Formula One where everything is just very secretive? Yeah, of course, yeah. Now it's getting a bit less and less, but uh, but of course, uh, yes, it is true that here everything is quite laid back, quite more relaxed, and of course the controls are still very, very impressive, so it's, uh, it's a very high level of challenge, of course. Did you have any talks about racing in IndyCar with anyone? I know that's more similar to the car that you raced in Formula 1, but didn't know if you had any interest or were approached by anyone. At the moment, no, I haven't had talks, but since I'm here now, I think we will, and I'm open-minded also. Uh, to, do, to do a little bit of both, you know. Uh, I think uh, why I liked NASCAR because it was a uh, independent series, uh, like IndyCar is sort of, you know, a continuation of Formula One in a way, but the American version. And NASCAR is so unique, you know, it's worldwide unique championship. There's nothing, no alternative to it really. Uh, and even if there are alternatives, they're much lower in the level. So this is why I was interested here, but yeah, for sure in IndyCar, uh, I would be confident to do uh, a very